you are enough and i know that sometimes in our society we tell each other that we are our mistakes we are our poor decisions but i believe that you are enough and i think that somehow god made us complete that there is everybody has something that is unique about them and sometimes we focus more on the things that we don't do right than the things that we can do and sometimes we listen to all those voices around us that tell us that we are not enough that we are not smart that we are not wise and yet we forget the most important voice which is the voice that tells us that we are important that we matter that we have something to contribute in this society and sometimes we think that just because you can't figure out what to do with your life that somehow you're not enough that sometimes because i can't figure out what i want to study in college that because i can't do this because i can't do the right job that i want and that means that i'm not enough and that is not true because we are enough we are more than the job that we do we are more than not figure out what we want to do in life the point is not to have it perfect the point is to understand that we have more to do in our community. We have something to contribute. You have something to offer. Your voice matters. And sometimes we focus more on, well, I can't do that. But the point is not to do things exactly like the, the person next to you. We all have our own differences. We all have our own strengths and we all have our own gifts. And the fact that you don't have the same gift as, as I do, it doesn't mean that you are not smart. The fact that you, you are not having, an, you are not an A-plus student does not mean that you are not wise. And I think that we always focus on grading each other, that somehow because you can't do that the way that I do it, then that means that you are not important. And therefore, we are always pressured to fit in than to stand out. You are wise, you matter, you are unique in your own ways and that is okay. And I think that we have to remind ourselves every single day that we are enough. We have something to offer, we have a voice and we have the power to change our community. We have the power to change the world. And if maybe you understood that you are enough, you will stop comparing yourself to everybody else. You will stop living on the expectation of everybody else and you start walking your own passion and your own gift and you offer the best that you can. You are enough. You are not your past mistakes. You are not the poor decision that you made last month or last week. You are enough. Despite what everybody says, despite that you can't find a job, despite that you're still confused about your own life and what you want to do, you are enough. And life is a journey. You may not be where you want to be today, but you won't be the same in the same place tomorrow. The point is to push through. The point is to learn how to speak to ourselves. And the point is to understand that you are unique. You are smart. You are wise. And you are amazing the way that you are. The way that God made you to be. You are enough. You don't need someone to give you applause. You don't need the praises of people. You don't need to compare yourself. You don't need to feed in. You don't need to follow the crowd. You are amazing the way you are. You are incredible just the way you are. And if you only you could see it the way God sees you, you will understand every day that you wake up, I'm still a work in progress. I may not be where I want to be, but I refuse to let my confusion about my, what I want to do in life. I may not be where I want to be, but I am enough. God is telling me that I am enough. And if you can tell that to yourself, you will know that you are enough. You are not just your mistakes. You shouldn't compare your, yourself to your friends. Yeah, maybe your friends have reached more and accomplished more. Just walk on your own path, in your own speed. And remind yourself every day, you are enough. <laughs>